A Honolulu City Councilman wants to change where money from traffic fines ends up. The hope is to give more of it to county law enforcement. Christy Tomashiro reports. Currently, money from traffic fines goes to the state, but Honolulu City Council member Calvin Say wants to change that. He says enforcing state traffic laws and prosecuting violators is paid mainly from county funds. I was just trying to address how we could support our law enforcement, the first responders, in a much more, I would say, generous and equitable way of the services that they do provide. Say introduced a resolution asking the legislature to give 50% of traffic fines and forfeitures to police and prosecuting attorneys. According to Say, this could help beef up police staffing. Because of the shortage, I thought that would be one approach that we could get some extra revenues in creating different types of bonuses for first-time officers who do apply to become police enforcers. State lawmakers tell me they're open to working with the counties to get more funding for public safety, but they're unsure how efficient this change would be. I think there is a concern that by allowing traffic fines that HPD cites people for, that money to go to the county creates a financial incentive for officers to then cite people. Lawmakers say the state does help fund certain operations of county law enforcement. I passed a bill years in a row that gives money to for cold case investigations. Uh, there's other ones like that where the, the state gives money to the counties directly for specific criminal investigations and criminal um, uh, anti-crime anti activities. Senator Chris Lee says there are other potential opportunities, like the state considering recreational cannabis, that can be a better option of revenue. The revenue from which can go directly back into uh, law enforcement, can go into things like um, stopping uh, minors from getting access to illicit substances. And there's a lot of great stuff that has been proven in other places that could be revenue streams. The resolution has been sent to the legislature for consideration. Christy Tomashiro, K212 News, working for Hawaii.